So, hello, captains of Armband. Welcome to a rapid fire session with Mr. Noah Sarawi, the winger from FC Goa. Yes, the winger that you all love. But the rules are pretty simple here, sir. We have 10 questions and you have to answer each of them within a word or a sentence. But don't worry, everybody gets a lot of time. We say this, but you can take your time. No problem. So, now moving on to the question answer session. The first rapid fire is a very interesting question. Who is your idol in world football? Say my favorite player is Cristiano, not an idol. Absolutely. The player people look up to like crazy in India. So now the second question is who's the best trainee at FC Goa? I'll say myself. <laughs> <laughs> truth. No, it's, it, it's the truth. It's the truth. When you are best, you are best. So the third one is who is the toughest ISL team you have faced up until now? Bangalore. They, they are one tough team to crack, especially in their defense. Such a solid yeah. defense. The number four will be the most memorable FC Goa moment for you until now. There's a lot of good memories, but I feel like this the big one is still loading <laughs> to win a cup. <laughs> I think that dream can come true very much this season. The team is performing so, so well. Now, moving on to the next one. The funniest guy in the FC Gold Racing Room. Who is the funniest guy? Oh, there's a few. Uh, I'll say Seri. Seriton. <laughs> Seriton. He, he, he looks like a very serious guy. But yes, he can be a bit funny. It's so interesting to know, you know what he's happens. The type of person, he's the type of person you doesn't have to say much, bro. It'll still be funny. <laughs> As you said, it's very, very interesting. But the if there is a chance that there is one movie, documentary, or book, anything that you will suggest to the viewers, what will be? My favorite, I would say show. Prison Break? The first season. Then nobody can top the first season of season. Yeah, break. I heard they're making a new one, a new, a new season, but I don't think it will be. I don't uh, think it will be as good. I will. I am totally on your page. I still can't forget the first season of Prison Break. It was so so good, so good, so good. And then if I had to say one Indian show, it would be uh, Delhi Crimes. Delhi Crimes is one of those shows that everybody binge watch it. Even after watching oh. one time, people will still binge watch it. It's amazing. Amazing. I was asking my physios, I was like, give me another one like that one. <laughs> you can also give Sacred Games a try. It's also a bit like the daily games, but it's more crime oriented. But again, it's very, very good. Very good. Mm -hmm. But who is the toughest player you have faced until now? Would you say in Indian Super League? Any. Be it the Indian Super League, be it on any other league that you have played, no problem. Um... I would probably say Indian Super League because people will know. <laughs> Toughest is my teammate now, uh, yeah. but uh, I will say Oday. Oday, because you know he's very good defensively and he's very smart. He's very, he's very, very smart. You know, actually, like I even told them uh, when he first came, I told them like when we played against them the first game, you know, he was like as if he knew the where I wanted to be and where I wanted to go. So before we played them at home, the uh, you know, uh, for the second game of the season, I actually rewatched the game um, to see how he defends. <laughs> you know, where he's supposed to watch me. You know, I'm the attacking player. So, and I think I had a good game, but he was, yeah, he, he definitely is, is, is challenging and uh, difficult to play against. And I will tell you the truth when I got the news that Ode is coming and after the Sunday Jingan is coming, I was saying it's illegal. It's illegal. You can't you can't have those two in your teams. Pure, the two best players defense. in the league. Like I, I love also Sandej, you know, he's my boy and everything. And he's a very, very good, very good player. Uh, him and Ode are like both pure defenders, you know, and it's 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 good to have you know, that we didn't have last season. And it, it was like it it's like it's a task to just go through them. Scoring the goal is a different task. It's very, very tough to just go past these two guys. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. But next one is a bit tricky one. That is, 
you have to pick any one of those. Giving an assist in the ISL final or scoring a goal in the ISL final? I would have to say scoring. <laughs> scoring in the ISL final, yeah. that too in the injury time, that will be something to remember. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but, but I'll take I'll take any of them to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> as long as the trophy comes home. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but now moving on to the next question, the penalty bit question that is the European club you doom to represent. Real Madrid, for sure. The Royal Club. The Royal Club. For sure. What a club, the 14 times champion. Maybe it will become 15 this year. But I will just ask this question. This is the last question that I fit for. It's the question that I want to always know from players. What is your favorite jersey number? The one that you want to wear? I'm wearing it. Seven. <laughs> And I knew that when you said you were a Cristiano fan, I knew you would say seven, but I still kept the question anyways. Yeah, but yes. But like even even like if the you know usually the jersey sometimes is not available, then I'll wear seventy-seven. But usually usually like it's you know the team that I've been I've been lucky enough to, uh, for the number to be available. And yes, it, it, it sometimes becomes a hassle. Even Ronaldo had to take the number nine jersey. When Raul was playing, he first came to yeah. Real Madrid. 